Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mr. Lawrence and in today's video I will show you how to get a trash vest on any outfit and you will also be able to get the IEA badges with it. If this video helps you out, leave a like and subscribe with post notice to never miss any of my videos. But before we begin, check out Hyper Resupply. They provide multiple GTA services such as modded accounts, money and rank boosts for all platforms. They are cheap, fast and reliable. Don't forget to use my code Lawrence at checkout for a 10% discount. The link will be in the description below, so check them out and let's get straight into the video. So as you guys might know, currently there are no versus missions in the game that have the trash vest outfits. So we will need to do the transfer glitch in order to get the orange trash vest. You will lose all of your saved outfits except for one. So equip one outfit that you want to keep and delete your saved outfits. Now appear pause menu, go to online and swap character. Your main character on the left side has to be a male character and your second character on the right has to be a female, otherwise it won't work. Now create a new second female character and copy the rank from your main character. Then just load into online and make way over to any clothing store. If they don't appear, find a new session and they will appear. While you are at the clothing store, we will first make the IA badge outfit. If you don't want the IA badges, you don't have to make this outfit. First go to the outfit section, then equip the first standard outfit. Now go to the accessories. From here you will need to remove your earrings. Then go to necklaces and purchase the white pearl necklace, number 11. Save this outfit in your first outfit slot. Now we will make the component outfit for the trash vest. First come over to the tops, then to leather jackets and purchase the blue cropped biker, number 86. This is the component for the trash vest. Stay at the tops and scroll down to tucked t-shirts, then purchase the black classic. This way we will be able to merge any top with the trash vest. Now head over to the pants. Go to sport pants and purchase the spotted muscle pants. This is so we can merge any pants with the trash vest. Now go to the shoes. If you want to be able to merge any pair of shoes, go to sneakers and purchase the pink plain high tops. I want the all white sport shoes, so instead of these sneakers, I will go to high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combat boots. Then go to the accessories. Go to earrings and purchase the BMW Deco earrings, number 40. This is so we can merge the IA badges with the trash vest. Then go to gloves and equip the light woodland armor, number 32. Save this outfit in your second outfit slot. Now open your interaction menu and take the easy way out to force a quick save. When you respawn, open your pause menu, go to online and start creator. Once you are in creator, create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert. Now open your pass menu again, go to online and choose character. Now you will need to delete your second character, so your female character. From here, if you are on the next gen version of GTA, click the link in the pinned comment because there is a workaround to transfer outfits on next gen. If you are on last gen, just press circle or B to go back to story mode. When you are in story mode, go straight back to online.
Once you are back in online, go to the clothing store. You will still have the outfit equipped that you wanted to keep. Save that outfit is slot number 20. If you did everything correctly, the other outfits are also transferred over. Now if you want the IAA badge on your outfit, equip the transferred IAA badge outfit. If not, just follow it from here. You can now start making an outfit that you want a trash vest on. You can even try to merge it on one of your saved outfits, but sometimes it will mess up your outfit. You can equip any top, I will equip a hoodie, and same goes for pretty much every clothing item. If you are doing it with the badges like me, make sure to delete the IA badge outfit after you made your outfit. From here, you will need to bookmark the job from the pinned comment. When you bookmarked the job, you will need to restart your game so it pops up in game. You can then find it through your pause menu under bookmarked jobs and then to missions. If you can't bookmark it for some reason, your friend can bookmark it and invite you to the job. Just make sure that the host changes the clothing setting to player saved outfits and then he can start. From here, you will need to press right on the d-pad once. The trash vest will appear on your outfit and then ready up. When you load in, make way over to your apartment. You cannot see it on the map, but you should know where it's at. Now just enter your apartment. If it doesn't let you in, blow yourself up on the blue circle and when you respawn, you can enter. Now make way over to your wardrobe. You can now see if this outfit is slot 19. Don't delete the trash vest outfit, cause after this we can use it to make multiple trash vest outfits. Then quit the mission through your phone. When you are back in online, you won't have your outfit yet, but now you can just equip it through your interaction menu. This time I will merge the trash vest on a different outfit. I will do it on a no top outfit. Then I will start the clothing merch job again. Change the clothing to player saved outfits, invite someone and start. Now switch your outfit once to the right again and ready up. Save this outfit to your wardrobe in slot 18 and then leave the mission. When you are back, you have the trash vest outfit and you can now repeat this. You can also add accessories and headgear to make these outfits even better and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.